Welcome to this video weather briefing. Thanks for tuning in. In this video, we are going to discuss the onset of the monsoon. Monsoon is a wind flow, and this wind flow change will bring some tropical moisture and then thunderstorms to parts of our region. This is Alex Tardy, meteorologist with the National Weather Service. All right, uh, what is the monsoon weather pattern? This is what's going to develop starting on Friday. Notice the upper level high pressure area. This is the upper levels of the atmosphere. All the heat over the land is rising over the Great Basin and allowing this system to strengthen. But also notice the weak low pressure system in the East Pacific. The squeeze between the two will send moisture in the mid levels all the way up to the Oregon coast. Then next week, early next week, Monday through Wednesday, that weak low pressure area retreats, but the upper level high pressure remains in place over the Great Basin, and you get a large area of deep moisture, subtropical moisture, that we call the monsoon flow driven, and that'll be across California as shown here. Okay, these are the best areas for receiving precipitation in this monsoon flow. It'll be our mountains. It'll also be the lower and upper deserts. And there's also the potential for enough moisture coming in the region in that southeast flow for a few thunderstorms to develop in the Inland Empire, as shown here. This image is for Monday, but this will also be in effect for most of early next week. Take a look at the lightning safety as this is lightning safety awareness week. Lightning is one of those impacts from the monsoon flow and can be deadly. All right, here is the outlook. We expect the hot temperatures to continue in the deserts and inland areas. Relatively seasonally hot, however. We also expect some coastal low clouds and fog, especially for Friday and Saturday. A lot of that will dissipate as the monsoon takes over. The thunderstorm chances start on Saturday, isolated in the mountains especially, and then they expand on Sunday into the high deserts and mountains. And then on Monday, Tuesday, that's our best shot for uh, inland valleys, for all the deserts and the mountains and foothills. And the threat likely continues on Wednesday. Humidity will be noticeably increasing really for all areas starting this weekend and then uh, most noticeable early next week as the monsoon is in place, that subtropical moisture. Heavy rain, well our first chance for heavy rain looks like Sunday, probably in the mountain areas and then anywhere uh, there are some thunderstorms on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, there'll be some locally heavy rain. So that increases our flash flood threat. So the scale for impact, uh, the most impact looks like it'll be next week, Monday through Wednesday, as that deep monsoon moisture is in place and we have that threat for heavy rain and flash flooding. Take a look at these links. Uh, on here, you'll find the latest flash flood warnings or watches that may be issued. Any hazard is shown at the link above. You can also take a look at some other links you can monitor the rainfall at the link in the middle as well. Always tune in to weather.gov San Diego for the latest watches, advisories, and warnings. They'll be posted right to our webpage. You can also follow us on Twitter and Facebook. Thanks for tuning in.